Hello, this is David Dave here. This is the first in a series of uh, show reviews that I'll be adding on. I might also review some books, movies, shows, uh, music, things like that. Uh, if you hear some noise, that's my uh, dog in the background there. Um, Today I want to be talking about the show Squid Game. Have you seen it? Well, if you haven't, don't. It's bad. It's really, really bad, yo. It has lots of violence and blood and scary stuff. And, well, it's just kind of stupid because it's basically like people that are willing to risk their lives for money. Yeah, money's kind of dumb and doesn't really do much for you. I mean, as you see on Stuffed Animal Magic Shop, we just collect rocks and sticks and leaves and stuff from outside. And, and that's just fine for us. We don't have to be, like, greedy for anything. So, anyway, on the show, it's fake, by the way. It's totally fictional, not real. But these people compete to win just money. That's all they get is money. And if they lose, they get, like, shot. And it's really bloody and gross. And you don't want to be traumatized. You don't want to be desensitized to violence because violence is stupid. It's not cool, not fun, not good at all. So don't watch it. Now, if you have watched it and you're having nightmares, I recommend Stuffed Animal, somebody like me. You can cuddle at night. Um, also, you can imagine it a different way. Like if you're seeing a blood in your head, imagine it as like strawberry jelly or as like ice cream or something like that, you know. Change the images in your mind, basically, with your imagination. And that can help. Uh, you can also put some uh, lavender under your pillow to help bring you good dreams. And, you know, just cuddle your stuffed animals tight and ask your stuffed animal to protect you from... Uh, you know, bad dreams, and hopefully it'll work. So anyway, Squid Game, no go.